Hi, in this video, I am going to show you how to connect uh, Joho campaign with Elementor from. Uh, okay, um, I'm using this plugin to connect Elementor with Joho campaign. And I already installed um, Elementor uh, form and uh, the related plugin here. Um, I already uh, created an Elementor form. And okay, let us get started. Um, you can create integration uh, here it will show the available form created on your elementor form um, uh, for now i already created i a form okay let us do the uh, authentication part uh, select your uh, data center uh, i mean uh, the one it will uh, show here like joho.com uh, if you are from e Europe uh, Union, then it will show Joho. Uh, EU. Okay. okay, let us go to the Joho API console. Oh, sorry client name is any name uh, any given name uh, but it can be joe uh, for uh, for now we are giving um, elementor uh, here it will be home page url and it will be authorized url copy the client secret and paste it here mm, copy the Ideal client secret. Okay. Authorization is done. Now click on. Okay. Uh, we will send uh, email, and you can uh, select more field. Uh, and uh, it, it is showing a uh, field from Elementor and WordPress and it is showing from Joho campaign. Okay, for now we will send by just email. And here is also conditional logic if you need it. Okay, we are done. Initial save. Okay, uh, let us uh, send and test data. Okay, now check if the data is here in our test list. Here you can uh, uh, say uh, check that it is here, and uh, this is the basic setup. Uh, for example, like you are even you, you want to use a double opt in uh, or want to take a uh, user consent uh, before adding it in list you can do it from uh, a setup and uh, click on uh, uh, sign up form then it will uh, before adding the contact uh, contact list it will uh, send an uh, um, consent mail to the user uh, then if he approves uh, then it will uh, show in here uh, also if you can also check if there is uh, the data is here or not uh, like if you got any uh, error or a problem just uh, copy this code and send it uh, to the plugin author um, okay uh, i think we covered almost uh, everything and uh, thank you for watching the tutorial